YouTube, how you doing? In this video, it'll be my first day back on Supercross. Uh, you'll get to see my literal first laps back on a Supercross track since the last Supercross round of this year. I was definitely pretty rusty the first few laps, but by the end of the day, I was feeling pretty comfortable and uh, it was pretty cool to see my progression throughout the day. But if you like this video, hit a couple buttons down low. It really helps me out and I'd appreciate it. But without further ado, let's get into the video. All right. Let's fucking go moto, baby. We're not really going to moto too crazy this first one. This is literally my first laps back on Supercross. So I'm just going to go out, get warmed up, go find a little bit of flow, get the timing down again. Let's take it nice and easy, baby. I think my clutch is like super loose gotta tighten that so we'll see how bad that i'm like gonna need to be holding this up dude What's up, dog? Yeah. How you doing? Nah, this is my first day back. This track is a lot to take in. Yeah. It's pretty big. You just need some time to just learn. Yeah, yeah. And ride. That's okay. You yeah, I just needed, a, you know. These guys have all been riding on it for a good bit. Yeah, Besides yeah. Devin, it's his first day too, but everybody else kind of has a track down, so it's, yeah. it's a lot. So yeah, I just need, you know, hop in on the end of the tail and. Get the timing back down, get the flow going, you know? Yeah, just, just ease into it. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, my goal for the day is just learn the track and uh, pick up the pace pretty quick and just uh, get things dialed on the new bike. Well. I'm grateful for the, me the mechanics getting getting me the new bike. Good. You're on. Uh, I'm just grateful to be back, back with the crew. Got a sweet new spot where I'm parked this year next to the sign up building. Got a little better service, trying to, you know, do some social media stuff. Uh, you know, I just want to be able to look back at, you know, these times, these are going to be some of the best times of my life. So what better time to document it than here and now. So um, goal for the day is to just get back into the swing of things, find a flow, get the timing back down. And uh, yeah, goal for the year is to uh, be a front runner in arena cross and consistent Supercross main event guy. Good. All right. We're going to do an extended warm up. Oh, <laughs> my 
like randomly sputtering. I hear that. Just see, you know. Should I just go back and try to mess with it? Yeah, I mean, we'll, we're going to take a break here in about 15 minutes anyway, so uh, uh, if you got a head start on it now, then you maybe have it figured out when you come uh, back. Fakey. Fakey. Oh! Well, I already got to do bike work. Got to figure out why my bike is sputtering. <sighs> it's always something. All right, well, I have some old gas in here. At least I think it's old, so I got to uh, pull the tank off. And I guess I'm gonna just dump this fuel, put some fresh fuel in it. I'm probably gonna change the spark plug too, and hopefully that'll answer our issues. What do I do with this? I'll just, what do I do, dump it down the drain? So, I just put the new spark plug in my bike. Now I'm gonna attempt to drain my tank into this old VP can. This should be fun. I'm gonna just get a funnel before I can spill this everywhere. All right, let's hope the foldable funnel doesn't let us down here. Try to get it on a better angle. I'm literally full, dude. I'm gonna dump a whole tank. 
Spilling the hell out of it, but better than I feel like if I didn't have this phone. What a shit show. Alright, bike's got a new spark plug, fresh gas. Let's go run it up and down the road, make sure this thing works. sputter at all so that's good i think we fixed it your boy is a mechanic he does a little bit of it all privateers man gotta be able to do it yourself what you factory boys know about working on your own bike filling your own gas shit man on a day's work boy bada bing bada boom huh let's go get this another try session two officially Yeah, it seems to be good now. What's going on, man? Dude, I went to and seat bounce that thing. It's kind of small. I, went into the I bet. Because I just almost did, I almost just did the same exact thing, dude. Yeah. If you can backside the table smooth and not like clip your back wheel, yeah. this three is pretty easy. This one. You ain't that one though still, right? Yeah, I, I mean, not really as bad as I thought. Like, all right, Taco with the wheelie boy again. Bike is mint. Got a couple of those triples down. I'm happy. Get the track a little more dialed in next couple of days. Maybe middle of next week. Jump in with A group boys. Get really back into the intensity level. But right now, those are some good practices. Just getting uh getting back into the swing of things. Learning some we're learning the track, getting the timing back down for the triples and stuff. Having a good time so far. If you can go two, three, yeah. or if if not, you would want to try to three in, but that's pretty big. No, that's a pretty I feel like I'm, that's like one of those things you really need to like trust your bike and like, my, my shock might be soft, I feel like, because when I try to really seat bounce something, I feel like I'm going to get that like, doo -doo -doo, you know? <laughs> Mm-hmm. 
feeling good. Yeah. Biggest thing for you, Bryden, is uh, just just getting laps in. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, don't, don't push don't it feel, too much don't yet. Don't feel like you gotta. Yeah. Oh, I gotta catch up to these guys quick. Like. Yeah. Just, Right? I flatlanded that fucking thing. I told you, dude. Smaller than Way me. easier. I'll tell you what, dude. I went. Two threes pops you up. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that, that two threes you. hit. Yeah. That pops. Like, got the confidence to like, be like, all right, I'm gonna try and go two three. Yeah. As soon as I'm over the two, I'm Look when in. I'm in the air on the two, I'm looking at the landing of yeah. the three. So when I drop in, it's okay. like it's like all right, I just know. Rah. Visualizing it. Yeah. All right. So this time. We'll run the same loop. Look through them. Good. I think, uh, Am I falling off the back at all? Not too bad. You get a little squatted at the end. You know? Yeah. Uh, are you hitting knees in fourth or third? Third. I'm third the whole time. These ones in fourth? supercross pretty stoked with uh just how fast i feel like i progressed today definitely way ahead of where i was in january uh before supercross this year so stoked on that yeah really just tried to get like some rhythms down get my flow back get the timing down again um getting those little you know first supercross day nerves uh kind of out of the way so um yeah man just feeling good about to uh, go hit the gym and uh, just kind of chill out for the rest of the night. Yeah, man, definitely more content to come. Let me know what uh, what else you guys want to see. I mean, I'm going to be here at club hopefully all of next year, um, definitely all the way through Supercross. So, you know, just going to be trying to make a bunch of videos, training every day and traveling on the weekends. And that's about it, man. It's part of the lifestyle. It's just living out of the van. Just trying to document it. These are gonna be probably some of the best times of my life, so why not video it now before I can't and uh, you know can't look back on it. So don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. That stuff really helps me out. And uh, yeah, until next time. You.